to EA Sports. I'm James Sabalski. So glad you could join us. Let's go. And we are about set to drop the puck tonight. The Islanders start with possession as we are now underway. Levels it with the hit. The cliche in hockey is you want to start the game hard and physical and really set the tone, and that's what he was doing right there. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Sorokin. The Mighty Ducks play it along the blue line. Barzell's moving the puck through his own zone. Saucer feed. Blocked in traffic. Shuts him down. And he avoids the poke check with some great edge work. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Good stand-up hit on the play. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Oh, James, he took a huge hit there. We'll have to have another look at that one, but looks like he's having a hard time getting up. Lots of time left in this period. Still looking for our first goal. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Breaks the top of the steal. You know he stepped on your toes there, James, but had to react to that massive hit. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Battle along the wall. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. And now he moves it to Johns. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Pellick. Quick pass to Lee. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. Passes it over. With possession along the wall. And there's the save. Throws one up to Michael. Tries to the crease. Answers it with an even better save. The Mighty Ducks will play it in their own end. And the puck skips away after that move. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still scoreless in this one. Minneapolis takes possession after that offensive zone faceoff. Can't hang on to the puck after taking it off. Look at this! Dishes it off! That's some smart heads up defensive play by Chara. New York's got the puck. Moves it to Silverberg. They've got the defense outnumbered. With the stop. New York's got the puck in their own end. McLean stick handling in his own zone. Minneapolis has possession of it now. Oh, just got a piece of that one with the glove to keep it out. Oh, shuts him down. Minneapolis has it near the wall. Kaprizov's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Oh, what a save in front. This might have been a case of look what I found by the goaltender because he's got one of the best, most accurate quickly shots in the game. Tosses it on to Marcel. Picked off by Granlin. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Great read by Marcel. And he's got the answer for that one. Minneapolis looks to break out in their own end. Trying to get back on the attack now. Stopped by the goaltender. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Duclair is out for the remainder of the game, James, with that injury he suffered earlier. We've just received word from the staff that he will be out for an indefinite amount of time. An unfortunate storyline here throughout the game, and now we know for sure he won't be back. And here's the pass to Engvall. The Islanders carry it along the wall. And Rossman brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Carries it in. And that's knocked away by Mayfield. Quick feed to Nash. And let's see what the call is. Engvall's been nabbed for tripping. Pace if they can go ahead in this one. 
shorthanded. Hooked away in the neutral zone. The Mighty Ducks pick up steam and are on the attack. Sends the pass in front, and that's intercepted. Puck clears the zone. Niskanen's got it now deep inside his own end. Moves the puck along the half wall. And that's intercepted by Paul Mary. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. Moves inside! And he opts to wait for more support. And they send it down the ice. Some solid defensive work in their own end with the poke check. Time running out on this power play. They've got one last chance here. Sends it across. Way too much congestion blocks that. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Richards will look to win the draw to continue this power play. And they win the defensive zone faceoff. Angle standing up, ready to go. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Pichon. Minneapolis fails to capitalize on the man advantage all alone. And it's broken up with a great defensive effort there. Well, that's what you call backtracking with a purpose, James. He thought that he was alone and in the clear, and the opportunity gets taken away. Great save by the goaltender. Just real smart positioning on that one. Richards draws a penalty. Looks like a slashing call coming up here. Play is stopped, and here's the official call. Mayfield's going off for slashing. of the fatigue goaltender right now, James. I mean, they've had puck possession. They've had the majority of it, and they found ways to move the puck and score.
just here in the late stages of this frame. Minneapolis has the one nothing lead. Granlin's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Quick shot, fantastic save. Angles it over to Barcel. And he hangs on to the puck. Minneapolis takes hold of the puck. The Mighty Ducks move the puck in the defensive zone. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Slides the cross ice pass. Knocks the puck down with a stick. Minneapolis with possession in their own zone. Shot! And he puts that one aside with ease. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Here they come on the attack. To his teammate! Minneapolis gains a hold of it. Sends a pass over. Quick pass to Chara. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Moves it over to Holmstrom. All right, time to get a clean sheet of ice here as period number one comes to an end. As you heard the horn sound, we'll be back with much, much more as this is going to be a fun one tonight. Limited edition team drinks are available tonight. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? Minneapolis will want to continue where they left off after the first period. They've got that one goal lead, but it's what they've been doing on the ice, getting shots through to the net, funneling everything and disguising the shots as well, has made them effective. Quick shot! Oh, a clutch save! aggressive and at the top of his crease and makes an outstanding save from the slot. Shakes off the coverage. Moves it quickly over to Michael. Oh, an unbelievable stop by Sorokin. Minneapolis has been on a roll offensively here and they lead it in the second. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Dismiss that chance. We're still in the early stages of this period. Minneapolis leads it 1-0. They win the draw and go on the attack. From the blue line, they take control of it. And that shot gets blocked by one of his own teammates. Quick pass to Faber. Here they come. Down the left side on the attack. Jabs the puck away. Minneapolis looks to get things going now with the puck. And he takes the feed. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Minneapolis takes possession in the neutral zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Islanders have it against the wall. And he makes a save there. And it's a quick pass to Pajo. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. And he gives it over to Darlene. Right up Main Street and on the attack. And the puck leaves the zone. They'll be forced to regroup at center. And now he angles it across to Richards. Handles the puck. There's a shot. And that one's turned away. Still has possession. New York's got it in the offensive zone. The Mighty Ducks gain possession. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. And now he passes up to Kaprizov. Slides it back to the blue line. And he loses control here. McLean's got it along the wing. Beautiful read of the defensive end by Solani. Picks up the puck in his own end. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Tries to feed it over to Horvath. Feeds the puck to Marcel. Coming down the left wing and into the zone. Comes up with the stop. Grabbed along the board by Horvath. Feeds it over. Moves it to pull up. Booming shot. Stops him cold. Puck grabbed by Marcel. The Mighty Ducks gain control of the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Hossa. And he takes the feed. 
looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Minneapolis has it behind the net. And he slides it quickly to Johns. A crazy foot! Oh, and he comes up with a stop. New York's looking to break out of their own end. Down the left wing and into the offensive zone. Comes up with a stop. The Mighty Ducks gain control of the puck against the wall. Minneapolis has it in the defensive end. Quick feed to Alfredson. Moves the puck. Drives it to the crease. The Islanders look to start the transition game. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Battle ensues for that loose puck along the boards. Minneapolis has the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Solani. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Here's a short pass to Holmstrom. Pushes it across to Solani. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Shot! He's known for his incredible quickness, James, but when he gets a step on you, he is all but gone. If he reads there's some ice and he can drive the net, he's going to take it. This time, the goaltender makes the save and denies him. Toss up the puck after that hit. Went for the dirty dangle and it goes sideways. Trying a nifty move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied, and that's what happened there. Minneapolis moves ahead with the puck. And that slides right out to center ice. Scooped up along the wall by Horvath. Slides it across. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. And that's hooked away. Makes the save. New York's playing it through the neutral zone. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. The Islanders have it now. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Fires it on net. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. And he slides it quickly to Alfredson. Takes it to the net. And that's blocked away. Moves the puck over to Fashing. Puts it on net. Just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Wow. Takes a shot. Oh, what another save. McLean's made an incredible play there, James. He stumbles in front of the net, but finds the puck and could have lost it, but manages to stay with it enough to get a shot off. Looks to pass it to Fashing. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. The Islanders have it behind the net. And that's broken up. Fires it! There's the horn bringing period number two to an end. 40 minutes down, 20 to go. Third period action is coming up. Welcome back to EA Sports. The final frame looms here as the officials set to drop the puck on period number three. They have dropped the puck here in the third. Cheryl, 40 minutes in the books now played. How do you view this one? New York's going to have to outwork the goaltender here, James. I really like their play in the offensive zone. They've driven the paint. They found ways to get the puck to net. They just haven't solved the riddle of the goaltender. They're going to have to get some net front presence and take away the eyes if they want to put it in. The Mighty Ducks lead it here early in the third period. They have been dominant in the offensive area. Horvath's won it in their own end. Passes it over. They score! And that's back-to-back -back goals! Well, nothing like switching the mention and putting your opponent on their heels and getting two in a row. Back-to-back, -back. here they come. Plenty of time you're in the slot area. You know that you're not going to have much time. That's why a quick wrister to the net can often do the damage. It's Barry. Minneapolis has come out flying to start this third period with a quick goal. They're now up by two. And the engine is really moving, isn't it? They're playing confident. They're playing with a sense of urgency. They'll need to keep that aggressive style, but be smart about managing the puck and making certain decisions with it. Taken along the wall by Horvath. 
Picking up momentum inside the neutral zone. And he keeps possession. Oh, a quick little pickpocket on the play. Gets in front of it. Minneapolis gets the puck near the boards. Quick pass to Johns. And that's intercepted by Barzell. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. The Mighty Ducks looking against the half wall. Oh, one of his teammates was right in the shooting lane there. Engvall swooping in on the attack. Moves it to the middle. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Moves it to Niskanen. And Ross got the puck in his own zone. New York's got possession of the puck. Slides it diagonally to Engvall. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Now a quick pass to Engvall. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Slips by the check. Here's a shot. Scores! And that's three unanswered goals. And as my mom likes to say, they're cooking with gas. They're cooking with gas. And you can expect that they have put their opponents on their heels. This is a team that knows that they've worn their opponent down. Now they've got to keep the pedal to the metal. Extends the lead to three goals here to start this third period. What was ever said in that intermission, Cheryl? Clearly working. Yeah, it's working all right. And I think even pre-game's off work because it has been a consistent effort right from puck drop, James. It's a shot mentality. It's owning the puck. And they have delivered in every aspect when it comes to that. The Mighty Ducks offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Came up with the save on that play. Fashing's got the puck along the wing. New York's got it along the wall. Jostled off the puck. Slides it quickly to Darlene. Levels him with the hit. Poked away at center by Pellick. New York's got it in their own zone. Minneapolis will play it from behind the net. Quick feed to Kaprizov. Big time saving goal as he gets all of it with the stick. He's such a phenomenal shooter, James. I mean, when he shoots in stride, he is absolutely lethal when he pulls that puck in and disguises his shot. He can change the angle so quickly, get it off fast. Goaltender always has to be ready. Picked up along the wall by Pellick. New York's got it in their own zone. Pellick's carrying it ahead. Kaprizov's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Here comes the official's call. Now you're down a bunch of goals here, James, and really you take the penalty because you're chasing the game and you want to get back into it, but this one, this one's a tough one to take. I love the one three one set on the power play unit they use earlier. Listen, they had success, they scored. But there's so many variations off of it. I love the bumper position that can act as a decoy, allow the puck to get through to create those seams and open up those shot attack lanes. Picked up along the boards by Barcel. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Minneapolis has possession of it now. And a great save! We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that club save. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Richards will look to win possession here on the faceoff and try to continue this power play on the right note. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? Trying to shake the defender. He's in. The Islanders will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Over the line they come. Quick feed to Johns. Great defensive effort breaking up the pass. Oh, look at the pass. Here's a shot and makes the save. With the steal. Quick pass over to Niskanen. That's not going to fool him. In the game of hockey, you know that your opponent is sold to attack and drive the net and really get in the eyes of the tender. And for the goaltender, it's really important. There's a lot of traffic in front to make sure they have their eyes. So without battling out looking your opponent for those sight lines, he does an impressive job of making that save.
save. Lee's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Minneapolis takes possession off the face-off. Here he is on the redirect. New York's got the puck short-handed. Wow, with an FD lead, the team looks comfortable, and certainly that power play did. Yes, they didn't execute. It didn't seem to have the urgency that they had earlier in the game. Stones him in front. Power plays dictate games, and this one did not. And the coach will not be happy with the setup or the opportunity that this unit gave them. And serves up a little knock on the play. The Mighty Ducks pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Michael. Oh, he got a little sliver of it, and it stays out. Minneapolis has been impressive to watch tonight. Numerous scoring opportunities, and they have converted on most of them. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. And that shot dies in traffic. Here's a chance to the middle, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Minneapolis holds a noticeable edge in the shot department. The big reason why they lead here in this third period. Michaels won the draw here, and they're going the attack. Takes the pass. Handles the puck at the point. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Here's a short pass to Sezikis. And it's a quick pass to Fashing. Minneapolis gains a hold of possession. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. The Mighty Ducks' top line has been so impressive coming onto the ice right now, midway through this third period. You know that they're so tough to defend. They skate well, and they love to shoot the puck. Minneapolis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Faber's got it in the defensive end. Works it across to Solani. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. The Mighty Ducks have it now. Minneapolis hasn't given much up defensively in this game. Their goaltender has seen everything. You know that it's always bragging rights when you get a big fat zero at the end of the game. You can say that our defense is the best. New York's got the puck along the boards. Holtzkrupp's taking it from his own end. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Takes a shot. Turns that one away. Oh, you might call that friendly. And they score! Well, I really like the effort areas in this game, James. You know, they didn't get frustrated, but they have found a way to break through in this game. You got to figure, you got to hope that maybe they can shell one back to back here and get themselves back in this game. We're always talking about the fancy goal. How about the hard work that creates it here, James? And you know that it's all about winning the 50-50 puck battle. Coaches always say you got to get your nose dirty. That's a prime time example. The Islanders haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to claw back from this two-goal deficit. They're running out of runway. They got to find a way to get some chances. Grabbed along the board by Niskanen. Quick pass to Darlene. Puck not loose after that hit. Oh, textbook hook check to turn that over. And now it's over to Richards. Pokes it away in his own end. Oh, he'll feel that one. And it's stopped by the crowd. Continues to lead here late in this third period. New York's got it in the defensive zone. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. New York's got a hold of the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Lee. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. Centering pass! And that's stopped! We'll get a face-off after the puck stays covered up. They 
got the extra attacker out here for the faceoff. Well, they'll be looking for a quick win and advance that puck right to the net. Offense is on faceoff, and he wins the draw. Taken along the wall by Nelson. And the puck skips out of the zone. They'll have to regroup. And now he passes it to Holmstrom. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. And that goes off course off a body. it off. Minneapolis a big time late in this third period. They have been the better team tonight. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And they'll go the other way with a great play by Holmstrom. Centering pass. Picked off in front. Here's a chance. based on the way they played, just simply wanted it more tonight, didn't they? Well, they wanted it more. It was a consistent effort all the way around, but, I mean, they held possession of the puck. I mean, their opponent was chasing the game, and they found the back of them net. It was under domination tonight. Thanks so much for joining us here. It was a fun one to call, and we will see you soon for all of us here at EA Sports. Stay safe.